Hello, Gamer Nom is back. And in this video, we're going to help this noob with the Buddha Fruit grind with no fight style, no sword, and no gun. But before we start, you can show your support by using Star Code Gamer Nom when purchasing your Robux. With every purchase you make, 5% will go to me, and this will really help me make better videos for each and every one of us. Where the actor slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dump. Okay, let's start. So first, we have two skills on the level 1 Mastery, Buddha Fruit, the Transform, and the Impact, okay? So you need three impacts in order to defeat a bandit. And there you go. So guys, we're gonna grind here until we reach level 10. This pass is kinda hard, I think, because again, the skill of the Buddha Fruit is not that strong. But don't worry, we can do this. Next island is the jungle. So we're gonna start with the monkeys. Guys, just a reminder, we're gonna use combat. To lure the enemies okay and for the damage all buddha skills so here you need to hit them four times with your impact in order to defeat the monkey there you go we're gonna grind here until level 15 once you reach that we are going to the next mob the gorillas they are located here so you just need to lure four at a time there you go jump on a high ground and use your exit skill guys this is kind of slow because the next mastery for the next skill, the Buddha Leap is 100. Level 20, the Gorilla King. So let's see who's stronger, Buddha or Gorilla. Or you can just stay here, just to be safe. <laughs> so guys, no problem getting damage. You can damage him here without him damaging you. And since we're safe, guys, I have a question. Can you guess how many X skills impact is needed to beat the Gorilla King? This is the fourth one. And for the first one that will comment the answer correctly, on the comment section, guys, I will pin your answer, okay? Okay, so let's see who will be the first one to comment the correct answer. So our goal here is to reach level 30. Next island is the Pirate Village. So here, we're gonna start with the Pirates. Gamer Nom is there a tip to defeat them easily. Yes, guys, just go here on top and just keep using your skills. Or if you are not lazy, use your skills, run around, use your skills, run around, okay? <laughs> So at level 40, you can start defeating the Brutes. So same strategy, X skill, X skill, until you reach level 55. Now you will unlock a quest. Yes, the buggy quest or Bobby quest. Now a new question, how many X skills to beat the clown? Guys, here I will reveal the answer because the answer is the same with the Gorilla King. So guys, if you answered 13 times, yes, you are correct. Imagine hitting a boss that much again. For the Gorilla King, it is 13 times 2. So let's see who will be pinned in the comment section. So guys, what is our goal here? Goal here is level 75. Here are the stats, 155 block fruits, 35 melee and defense. Next island is the desert. So here, we're gonna start with the desert officers. To be honest, this is the one of the hardest fruits to grind. If you're not gonna use fight style or sword. Guys, check this out. The mastery so far is 42. For the next skill, the mastery needed is 100. So guys, we're just gonna fast forward this stuff here. We're gonna grind until you reach level 90. There you go, using impact only. The next island is the frozen village. Make sure to buy the sky jump, the enhancement, and the flash step. Next mob to defeat is the snow bandits. Door 4, jump here, use your X skill. The only problem here is you're gonna wait for your cooldown to defeat them. But guys, no worries, very easy. Next up is the yeti. So guys, again, how many times do you need to attack this with your X skill in order to defeat him? Guys, can you guess? If you guessed 13 times, you're wrong. If you answered 14 times, you are still wrong. The answer is 15 times. <laughs> Target level here is 130. Next island is the Marine Fortress. So guys, make sure to buy the Black Cape located here on one of the towers for 50,000. So guys, at 130. You can start defeating the Vice Admiral and finally, our Master is at 84. So guys, there is a high chance that we will reach Master 100 here. And since we're gonna unlock the Buddha Leap, the first time that I fought Vice Admiral, it took me only 12 access skills or impact to defeat him. Maybe because we have the Black Cape. Oh, here it is guys. She skilled the Buddha Leap. There you go. Finally, we have two skills to damage an enemy. I hope that our grinding will be faster. So 220, next island is the prison. So here we have three bosses. First is the warden. So you can do wall strat. The only thing I'm worried is the C skill, the Buddha lip. Because you might glitch inside, right? But I tried it. There you go. Don't worry. No glitches. 
Anyways, we're gonna do server hop here until you reach level 230. And since we're doing server hop, yes, we've been attacked several times. So for the attacker, the light fruit user, oh, you're trying to hide at the back of the warden, eh? You don't know the power of the Buddha lip? Boom, there you go guys, one hit. So at level 230, we can start defeating the chief warden. Same strategy, wall strat, and that's it. No further tips. There you go. You can start defeating the next boss one at 240 here. We're going to still use wall strat, but you need to create distance. Why? Because he can hit you with this. But aside from that, everything will be easy. Target level here is 350 guys. Again, 350. We're gonna serve up until you reach that level. Next island is the Magma Village. So here, we're gonna start defeating the Magma Admiral. So Gamer Nom is their strategy here. No guys, we don't have a wall strat, a stone strat, or whatever strat. Technique here, use all your skills, right? After that, dodge to the side because he will use his own skill. Well, let's wait for it. There you go, that skill. After that, you can use your own skills to damage him. Just repeat until you defeat the Magma Admiral. So guys, is it easy? Yes, it's easy. Unless you fight someone who is using a Magma Awakened Fruit like this one. Boom. Guys, he one hit defeated me. I don't know why he did it. I don't know why he is in the first seat and awakened uh, a Magma Fruit user. Shout out to you, bro. From now on, we're gonna call those high level players killing low level players in the first C flexors. Check that out, guys. He's still here. Anyway, we're gonna leave this area at level 425. Next island is the underwater city. So, here we're gonna start defeating the Fishman Lord. Guys, same strategy on our previous videos. Lure him here. There you go. And use your skills. Don't worry with the Buddha Lip. We won't glitch inside. There you go. I've already tried it. So, guys. Again, we're gonna server hop until you reach level 500. So almost server hop starting from the, uh, what do you call this, Marine Fortress, Vice Admiral, right? Next up, the Skylands. We're gonna go in the upper yard and start defeating the Whisper. For the Whisper, we have a Stone Strat. So just jump here on this stone and he cannot damage you with his Bazooka or Cannon. I don't know. Is it Bazooka or Cannon? Well, anyway, just use your X and C skill to damage him. Wait for him to use his skills. No need to dodge, and that's it. Target level, 625. Wait, Gamer Nom, how about the Thunder God? Guys, he's so far away, I don't want to defeat him, okay? So next is the Fountain City, our final island. And check this out. Mastery 198, we're almost there. You're about to unlock the Buddha Explosion, so just kill maybe. And to 16 Galley Pirates, and that's it. For those who don't know, Buddha Explosion is the final skill of the Unawakened Buddha. So guys, here it is. Let's try it out. Boom. Okay, so that's it. We've unlocked all the skills. We've reached the final island. We're gonna reach level 700 here and that's it. Make sure to finish the prison quest and go to the second sea. I will end my video here. Guys, tomorrow is the update. I'm so pumped up. Again, see you to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters. I really appreciate you all. This is Gamer Nom, and see you tomorrow, guys.